same gun shop that held a coyote hunt contest now has a new animal in its sights. This time, it's prairie dogs, small critters that animal rights activists call defenseless and harmless. But the hunt organizers say prairie dogs are pests who cause serious problems on farms and ranches. News 13's Lise Mitri has both sides from the Newsplex. Lise? Dick, Jessica, opponents say it's just a cruel publicity stunt, but gun shop workers say they're standing up for hunting rights. Gunhawk firearms in Los Lunas sparked protests and headlines nationwide with its coyote killing contest in November. The gun shop got hundreds of angry letters and phone calls, even death threats. It was pretty ugly stuff. They, you know, they, they talked about, you know, our families and, and you know, blowing the store up. But they say they're not going to let that stop them. When we did the coyote hunt, it was taking up basically the hunting rights. And after the coyote hunt, we got a lot of thanks for it. We got a lot of outpouring of support. And we want to show that we're going to do it again. We're going to be there for our hunters consistently. They're holding another hunting contest from August 10th to the 17th, but this time there's a new target. Prairie dogs. The shop says they're a problem for farmers and ranchers. They made up these shirts for participants. And a rifle like this is the prize for the hunter who kills the most. New Mexico deserves so much better than for our state to be known as um, the capital of killing contests. Animal rights groups are calling on Gunhawk Firearms to reconsider. They say this is nothing more than an excuse for publicity. I feel kind of sorry for the, 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 the people that take part in this event because I, I don't think they're hunters. Um, I know a lot of hunters and I know hunters respect wildlife, they respect the laws, and they give animals a fighting chance. The gun shop owner says he won't be directing people where to hunt. They're just expected to follow the law. The state land office is reminding people not to trespass on state trust land. Back to you. Okay, Lise, hunters killed 39 coyotes in the contest last November, and Gunhawk does plan another coyote contest later in the year.